In this application, we'll be cutting a custom palette that's roughly 15 inches square. First step is to map out where we want our gasket to go. We'll insert the gasket along the outside edge and cut in to create a vacuum area. At this point, we want to make sure we follow the best practices of cutting the ends of the gasket square and a little long so they're compressed when the two ends are butted together. Now let's figure out our vacuum force. The vacuum area we've created is 12 and a half by 14 and a half. Those multiplied together gives us a surface area of 181 square inches. Multiply that by 14 and we get a vacuum force of 2,534 pounds. Plenty for this application. For this part, we're drilling, tapping, and pocketing using some high-speed tool paths, though not as fast as you see here. You'll also notice the part hangs over the chuck a bit, but again, we have plenty of vacuum force to keep it in place. All done, and it looks like we sucked in a little bit of coolant, but that's never a problem for the SmartVac 2.